Buffalo, a Dundalk dance studio is reeling after it says all of its performance gear was stolen. That's right. ABC2 News' Brendan McNamara joins us live outside the Royal Performing, Performing Arts Center where those items were driven right off the parking lot. Brendan? That's right, Kelly and Jamie. Yeah, that young dance team of about 100, they had just gotten back from a national competition where they won a lot of awards. That trailer was parked right here in the parking lot Monday night. By Tuesday morning, they say it was gone. Their country-themed show, Wild Judges in Ocean City, winning first place for production. We have a 10-foot barn in two pieces. We have fence posts. We have a, a, a cardboard cow that stands up. We have chickens that are zip-tied to two remote control cars that go across the stage. Now all that's left are the dancers themselves. It wasn't just a trailer that was taken. It was something from the community that was taken. These kids work so hard all year. The Royal Performing Arts Center says its black travel trailer was full when it disappeared earlier this week, containing $1,000 in costumes and props, which took months to build. A lot of that stuff's not replaceable. Uh, just from the effort and the time that we've put in, uh, the girls have put in. Hours and hours and hours of time that we have spent in this studio putting it together, making it. And that doesn't include the rewards for all this practice, the trophies. A lot of these trophies are taller than, than some of our students. They're gone too. The bench that was stolen was her duo with her best friend. When I told her last night, she literally broke down and cried for 20 minutes. And owner Denise Rogers is betting the thief didn't like what they found. They didn't need to keep those things. They could have taken them out and set them out front and... You know, if they still want to bring them back, it would, it would be nice. But even without props, it's on to the next performance because the most important part of the show is right here in this room. We're a team. Teams stick together no matter if you win or if you lose. We will go past it. We will, we will plow through it um, because that's what we do. says it is investigating, but it does not have any witnesses of the theft. The team says that it's going to keep moving on. It's going to try to figure something out by the next time it has to perform that particular show, which will be in December. In Dundalk, Brendan McNamara, ABC2 News. Uh, 